Such a surprising sight to a lot of folks on St. Augustine Beach. See for yourself, the pier is not reaching the water. It's all part of the St. Augustine Beach Restoration Project, which is happening right now. Yeah, that's right. On your side's Drew Cosgray spent the day at the pier speaking with beachgoers about uh, the unique site there. Drew? Yeah, as you can see behind me, I have a really good view of St. Augustine Beach. That's the water, as you see. But I want to show you what exactly we're talking about tonight. And if I move this camera over just a little bit, all that sand, you see that? The water that I just showed you used to rise up all the way to where that sand is. But as you can see, there's no water there now. Uh, we did a little bit of research and we were like, why is it being like this? Joshua May and his family were not expecting to see so much sand on this year's family vacation. Past 10 years we've come and we've never had something like this going on. It's because of the beach renourishment plan. On February 22nd, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineering in Jacksonville announced their plan. The plan will place approximately 2.5 million cubic yards of sand on eroded beaches within the city of St. Augustine. Because of this, there is no water like there usually is under the pier where people are now setting up base for their beach day and being extra careful with the rust on the piers. And we actually, especially because like the piers have all that rust and some of it's fallen off, we had to make sure we cleaned up our little spot. That way, because I have two little girls and don't want them playing with rust, you know, even if they're tetanus shots up to date, you know, you don't want your kids playing with rust. The plan, according to May, has also changed the vibe him and his family are used to when they come here every year. Well, normally, you would have the good amount of people and you know that's that beach atmosphere but with having less people it's almost like kind of like a little bit more private and as i was leaving here earlier i literally heard someone on the phone saying you have to be here this is nuts construction is expected to continue on but in the meantime this is drew cosgray with first coast news on your side reporting in st augustine thank you so much drew and right now st augustine beach restoration crews are working in the area of the 13th to 15th street access points. Crews will then continue to move south with work expect to be finished there in early August.